guys, it's Amy Jobson here for Event TV. Autumn is in the air, bringing home the biggest and best films to event cinemas. It's an exciting month at the movies with action-packed sequels, fun-filled comedies and reimaginings of some old beloved tales. Here's your April at Event Cinemas. bottle the magic of cinema, it would look something like this fantasy adventure. The Jungle Book is an epic journey of self-discovery, expected to be a huge hit with everyone in the family. It's a reimagining of Walt Disney's 1967 film based on the tale by Rudyard Kipling, and one that will make a great big screen experience. You are a man cub who wants to live in a jungle. How do you know that? Kid, I got ears. My ears got ears. Only I can protect you. That's a song about the good life. He will stop at nothing until he has this boy. If anything happens to that kid, I'll never forgive myself. Huntsman Winter's War is a prequel slash sequel to Snow White and the Huntsman and sees Academy Award winner Charlize Theron cast in another evil role, which she does so well. Our own Chris Hemsworth is back, joined by Jessica Chastain, to play the two good warriors who defy the Queen by falling in love. Emily Blunt gives Elsa a run for her money as the Ice Queen Freya closing her heart to love and building an army instead. I thought I made you strong, but you're as pathetic as you ever were, little sister. This is my kingdom. Did you say something? With the mirror's magic, I'll rule the world. That mirror's an evil and dangerous thing. We have to destroy it. Together. I'm headed straight for the What are you gonna do? Be the hero who defeats the mirror and saves the entire kingdom. I pray much. Are you ready, Huntsman? Aye. I'm stronger than all of you. Shall we find out? The Divergent series Allegiant follows in the trend of young adult novel film adaptations, where the final chapter is split in two. Based on the popular series by Veronica Roth, Allegiant is the beginning of the end, with Shailene Woodley reprising her role as Triss in this sci-fi fantasy. She is joined by Theo James as Four and longtime favourites like Jeff Daniels and Australia's Naomi Watts. Watts returns as Evelyn, the factionless leader and Four's mother. I could never imagine that I'd be standing here. It's time to go beyond the wall. This is not the place that we thought it was. 
win in a fight between the Cap and Iron Man? Or better yet, which side will you be on? The battle begins in Captain America Civil War, the third instalment in the Captain America series. Of course, we see Chris Evans and Robert Downey Jr. return, joined by Avengers favourites like Scarlett Johansson as Black Widow. But there's some awesome new additions to get pumped for. Spider-Man enters frame with Tom Holland's debut in the role, but it's Black Panther played by Chadwick Boseman we're most excited about. Paul Rudd's Ant-Man also joins the crew to kick some serious butt. I know we're not perfect. But the safest hands are still our own. started a war. Stay down. Final warning. I could do this all day. All right. I've run out of patience. On to Ruth! Hey everyone. Who here wants to hear about an unfreaking believably exciting opportunity? Ooh. Huh? All right. Woo! Look at this group. All right. What's with all the long faces? Did somebody die? <laughs> yeah. Oh, spaghetti died last night. Oh, spaghetti. The cat. The cat. Oh. How do you come up with this stuff? I mean, this is Michelle Darnell, the boss, is a character that's lived inside of you like a dirty yeah. secret for, for a long oh, yeah. time. <laughs> that's that's what's rattling around in here. Can you imagine? That's just the one I'll admit. Think of, think of the crazies that are in here. Yeah, 15 years ago, 15, 16 years ago, did her and literally was like, yep, I know everything about her. You need to keep your tongue inside your mouth for this to work. I ask you to keep your very specifically. So keep tongue out. No. You did say that, Claire. I said get your tongue out of the picture. She's got to breathe, Claire. Sandy wants to be hungry. Sandy gets very cry when she's hungry. Her introduction is she flies down on a bird that's you on, know, a phoenix. on a phoenix that's shooting flames into a you know stadium full of people. So it's a credit to Melissa with how prepared and uh, what a handle she had on the character that it was. She was able to make it so as good as I think it is. Uh, in the boss, there's obviously a lot of physical comedy, which I'm guessing you'd probably have a stunt person. I, I do have a stunt person, and I'm an idiot. And I like to do everything. Well... This is so bad. Oh, God! Oh, God! Also, I just think audiences are so sophisticated now visually with watching everything on YouTube and seeing real falls and seeing real this and real that. You can't cut into it 50,000 ways like you used to. Now, do me a favor and tell me if I have any streaks on my hands. <gasps> oh, God, put it away. Huh? Put it away. Hi, Raquel. It's Rachel. Go grab your backpack, honey. We don't need to brush our teeth today. Our teeth are fine. Yes, yeah, filthy. It's a filthy, wonderful vice, this film. Do you have any reservations about being part of a film like this? No, I I might appear squeaky clean, and I'm often a goody-goody, but I laugh at the raunchiest jokes. I enjoy making fun of myself. I think it keeps your ego in check, and I think everything deserves to be made fun of. If your breasts could speak right now, I think they'd be saying, Claire, please don't zip me up in your jeans. That's, You're gonna zip a nipple. That's not what they'd say. Let me see this. It's very often a fit issue. Why do these have so much All right, well, <gasps> Claire, it's like Geppetto. How, how difficult is it to, to work with these two, with Ben and uh, Melissa? They're the worst. They're like so nice to each other and they're just always smooching and they're always agreeing and it's like, ugh, show us some drama, you know? We're a circus family. You know, the kids are with us. We, we go everywhere together. They come to set. They find us super boring. They leave set. They go hang out in our trailer and, you know, they're like, where are the markers and the M&Ms? I'm like, you want to hang out for a little bit? They're like, nah, we get it. 